George, George, George of the jungle, strong as he can be. Watch out for that tree! George, George, George of the jungle, lives a life that's free. Watch out for that tree! When he gets in a scrape, he makes his escape with the help of his friend. An ape named ape, then away he'll schlep on his elephant Shep, Magnolia, and Ursula stay in step. I know, George. But we were only fostering Tusky, and now he's grown up and needs to live his own life. But Tusky, George's favorite pet. <laughs> George, it's not fair to Tusky to keep him here any longer. Tusky scored you twice last week. Oh, he not mean to pop George's lung. And he's not housebroken and smells like a wolf. Okay, Ape, you right. Me say goodbye and... Come on, George. I'll cook your favorite meal to cheer you up. All done your coconut gettys of brownies? Mm-hmm. Feeling better now? Come on. Let's get you to bed. <laughs> Welcome back, Abe. It's good to see you. It's good to see you too, Swirl. Have a seat and we can begin. <sighs> Remember, you two, no one can know about my secret bathroom. Abe, tell me about the jungle. Well, I don't like to brag, but it's rather marvelous. I would like to see it someday. Oh, Swirl, this is your home. Everything a very expensive toilet could want is right here. But, hey. Shh. Now have a good night, and I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Swirl! Swirl, what are you doing here? The jungle is very beautiful. I would like to see more of it, eh? You need to go back to the bathroom right away. No one can see you out here. Why not? Because one, leaves give me a rash. And two, if my friends find out about my secret special bathroom... Uh, Abe, who you talk to? Poop poop! <laughs> Me, George. <laughs> George, I'd like you to meet an old friend of mine. Swirl. Swirl Martin the First. Please meet you. <laughs> I'm very polite, but handshake a little clammy. Yes, well, Swirl only came to visit for a few minutes and... But I want to see more of the jungle. Wait. If eight friend Swirl Martin wants the jungle, George Happy show him around. It must not get out much. So pale. And so, George took Swirl Martin the First on a tour of the jungle. This big jungle where George worked. That lion eat George once. That snake also eat George once. That bird eat George. And George too big to fit in throat. Jungle very hungry. Show me more, please. Swirl, you shouldn't bother George. He has important work to do. Nah, animals can eat George later. This way! This waterfall! Oh, nice to float in. 
This volcano, way too hot to float in. <laughs> this banana tree. Ooh, this apple tree. This watermelon tree. This burrito tree. <laughs> this underwear tree. And this soothing lotion for burns tree. Oh. Can we see more tomorrow? No, no, no. Uh, Swell, you have to go home to, uh, Porcelania. See you tomorrow, Swirl Martin the First. <laughs> ah, we all had a very nice time today, but your job is in here. Not gallivanting around outside. But, Abe, I could help you in the jungle. I've read all of your books. I know many things. You don't understand, Swirl. You're a toilet, not a jungle helper. And besides, you can help me best right here. I can't believe we ate a thousand apples. You know better way of stopping avalanche? Touche. You rest here, George. I just need to make sure we got them all. <laughs> <laughs> Magnolia, have you seen your amazingly awesome friend Swirl Martin? You bet. He's helping me with my research. Thanks, Swirl. <laughs> now I can tag all the fish for science. I have no idea how we just did that. Tag, 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 tag. Yes. Well, Swirl's vacation is over, and it's time he left. But he has to put all the water back. <laughs> I'm sorry, Swirl, but you're a very fragile and expensive toilet, and you need to stay here where it's safe. There. I'm afraid you'd have to tunnel your way out of here now, and that would take months. I'm glad we had this little talk. Good work, George. I'm sure we'll find their mother soon. Too bad Swirl not here. He's so great at helping George be good king. Yes, I suppose he was. Have you guys seen Swirl? He was helping me finish my paper on sloths and their mysterious hats. Um, well, no, I'm afraid. <laughs> Where pale round Swirl? He show Ursula how to taste animal fear. Well, I thought you could use some cheering up, so I brought you a brand new... <gasps> Swirl, what are you... Eight months later. <laughs> Swell. <laughs> when I find him. All safe, birdie baby. George, that was amazing. Um, George, know you? It's me, Ape. I was trapped in my secret. I got lost on my way to buy milk. Hey. Ape, I'm your mentor? No, Swirl George mentor. See, Swirl make George great jungle king. Where is he? And who are you again? I was only gone eight months. Oh, oh, we met at Bernard's party last April, right? I don't know where Swirl is. He's such a busy guy. We're shooting a TV special next week. The mysterious world of sloths and their many different hats. <laughs> Whoa, sheesh. Okay. Uh, maybe he's with... What the... Ah! 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 Stop! It's me, Abe! No, you dinner! <laughs> I'm looking for Swirl! Why do you not say so? Swirl teach Ursula how to be scariest hunter ever. All animals fear Ursula now. Just way Ursula like it. Lock me in my own bathroom. Take my life and my job and my friends in. Oh, hello, Abe. Eh? Swirl, who your new friend? Ah, ah, ah. You stole my life! You wouldn't let me have one. Ha! <laughs> 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 
the shoulder of George. Ursula's eyes glittered as she pounced on Magnolia. All these moments were almost flushed away like tears. No! <laughs> Why? Why did you save me? Because I'm sorry. Sorry for everything I did to you. Thank you, ape. I shouldn't have stolen your life. Instead, I will go and find my own. No. Thank you, Swirl. Hey, where's Swirl? And who are you again? Remember me now? George thinks so. Ape. You're an ape and your name's ape. That's not confusing at all. <sighs> Ursula Miss Swirl. Me too, Ursula. But he taught me a very important lesson. Hi, I'd like to order a new toilet. No, no, just a normal one this time. Please. Life in the jungle isn't all big danger and big rescues. Henry, George tell you twice now, no rafting. <laughs> oh. Sometimes the king of the jungle has to sweat the small stuff. Yeah. George, take baby stretchy horse to a safe place. Ow! Aww, George no be mad at you. And the bigger problem? Hold still, little wiggly. Oh, sorry. Well, sometimes they fall through the cracks. George! Shouldn't you be dealing with this? George, maybe it's time we brought on some help. You know, to take care of all the little things. You mean like <gasps> Tiny George? <laughs> High five, Tiny George! George! Go, go, Tiny George! Or we could start a club for young animals, teaching them how to help others. <gasps> yes! Like when George was George Kateer! Who won first roast banana? Coconut? Log? Pony? What matter? Not hungry? <laughs> yeah, I'll make some posters and spread the word. And George makes scarves and badge thingies! Junior Jungle Achievers? Could this be any lamer? But it is a perfect opportunity to destroy George! I need an expert infiltrator! Please, 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 is Shaga the Lemurian, jungle mercenary, tamer of the rare rodeo rhino, and the even rarer rodeo lemon, thief of the silverback of Ted, and then escaper from the angry fists of Ted, shaver of the dreaded mustache of woe, and wielder of the legendary axe, Deborah. Look. All you need to know is he's crazy and ruthless, as long as you can afford his price. A single doll's head. Cuspid Jr. After you 
joined these achievers and destroyed George of the Jungle. Sega! Sega! Don't even. And then Cuspid earned every merit badge and became the best junior jungle achiever ever. Oh, the end. Good night, Doctor. Good night, Cuspid. I love you. Why are you still awake? And don't even think of sneaking out to join the achievers when I sleep deeply in my soundproof bedroom all the way on the other side of the lair. <laughs> George, welcome all Junior Jungle Achievers. First, you get official Junior Jungle Achievers scarves. George, we need to talk. Ape say anything in front of Achievers. We Jungle Brothers now. Okay, for the start, that lemur has issues. And you're aware that's cuspid? Moo? Ape. Nobody left out of Jungle Achievers. Friends camp without George? But George thought we all George Kateers. Et tu, Bone? Yeah. Who wants merit badges? Every junior Jungle Achiever needs to know how to start a fire. Will achiever be unless they could swing to trouble double fast. Nope. Swing like George. Oh, right. <laughs> Nothing warms the heart of a junior achiever like a good rescue. George Monkey! Ooh, hoo, hoo. Roar. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Help! Who helped Monkey for rescue badge? <laughs> Good, Shaga. Shaga, rescue done. George have merit badge for Shaga. Uh, where Shaga take George? Excellent question. Where indeed? Is it the confusing cul-de-sac of no return, or the dreaded valley of the Valley Girl? Like, hello, OMG, we are so totally dangerous right now. Or is it the classic cave that's really a monster? No. It looks like it's going to be, oh, nice choice. The Pit of Small Bitey Animals. Shaga. Shaga. Wait, what's Shaga doing? Cuspid <laughs> 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 saved George from accident. High five, toothy guy thing. That wasn't an accident, George. Yeah! Yay! High five! Shaga! Shaga! Up high! Achiever, never let other achiever down. Cuspid, best achiever ever. Oh, shucks, guys. All I wanted was to go camping, maybe poke some dead things with a stick, but instead, I found... Shrupug! Yeah. Friends! Traitor! Backstabber! Turncoat! You dare defy me? I'm going to root canal you into the next century! <gasps> Unless... Cuspid! You're a genius! A totally incompetent accidental genius! You're not going to drill up my insides? By saving George and getting rid of Shaga, those idiots trust you now! It's a double bluff! I'm... I'm... I'm not quite, but almost somewhat a tiny bit proud of you! You are? Really? I... Oh, golly gee! And I can't wait to see the look on George's face when you betray him! Betray him? Uh-oh. Poor Cuspid, torn between his creator and his new fellow achievers. Gosh, what do I do? Golly, golly, golly! Cuspid! <laughs> Cuspid, best achiever ever! Hug! Friend hug! 
Cuspid! Cuspid, they can't give you what you've always wanted! The love of your creator! <gasps> Doctor! <laughs> and then Cuspid knew what he had to do. Sleepyheads. But how? Hey, guys! <gasps> Cuspid! Mm, George give very disappointed merit badge. How about one for no good double crossing? Uh, yes, that too. Mm -mm. George thought Cuspid was friend. But, but... Enough with your dumb badges already! <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> Next time, I could just shoot them instead. I am George's friend. I am George's friend. Grab the crown. I'm fine. Grab George's hand. It's okay. The tooth fairy's coming for me. <gasps> She's so pretty. Cuspid? Cuspid! Here, merit badge for a hero. Cuspid, I can't believe it. I almost nearly kind of maybe loved him. Gotcha! What? You love me. <laughs> How did you? I'm made of enamel, guys. Sheesh! Ow! Still smart. Something fierce, though. Ow! Ow! Wait! Hey! Ow! Oh. Stop it! I will show no affection for you! Ha! You already did! George feel warm, fuzzy. That's probably the weasel in your loincloth. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, couple bad apples in first group, but George trusts all new Junior Jungle Achievers. Uh, George? Now, who want earned merit badges? Ooh, red dots have party on George!